Deploy units, select a legionnaire and deploy a list and click on a deployable hex. All right. Select the veteran with a plasma gun and deploy him here. I like the sound of that already. So let's see, a veteran with a plasma gun. Now you're kind of facing the wrong way, but we'll take it. But you just deploy a standard legionnaire into the same. All right, so let's go with a standard legionnaire. So we finally get to make our own squads. So they are, there is a chance to do a good mix of anything that you want. Multiple legionnaires can be placed into a single hex. Each hex can contain up to three legionnaires. Deploy your sergeant here. Deploy the rest of your legionnaires, then finish deployment. Enter units can be deployed by clicking on them. All right, so we got, um, let's see, we got 12 more legionnaires that we can mess around with. Let's go ahead and get this as a full squad. We'll give our commander some uh, some love. Make sure he has the people he needs. Let's see, can we go over here on the other side? We sure can, and I like it because it's nice and uh, nice and blocked off. This one over here, not so much. We need to get to the evacuation zone. I'm guessing there's going to be tons of enemies over there. Where are we at right now? All right, so we got three guys here. There is a imp impediment right there. Where? What is that? A ramp? It might be a ramp of some sort or a cliff. I don't know. We'll, we'll go take a look at that as soon as we can. But that is where we really want to go. And there's a lot of stuff on this map. Okay, so let's go ahead and throw down six more people. And we are good. Press enter to finish. Are there enemies down there? I don't think there is. Select this unit with the plasma gun. All right. This is a piece of destructible terrain. Attacking it via shot or assault will destroy it. Each weapon has a weapon ability. These trigger when used in an attack. When a unit has multiple weapon types, only one of the weapon abilities may be chosen. While hovering over the target, select a weapon ability and shoot the destructible terrain. So, R and F. Bolter Plasma Gun. Alright, so we're going to go with a Plasma Gun. Greatly increases attack, but may backfire causing damage or death at zero armor. <laughs> Did it destroy? Oh, there we go. I, I was expecting like a big explosion. Come on, this is gonna be VR. I want to see the flames. I want to see the explosions. And now we got some enemies over here that we need to kill. So this is gonna be a little interesting. Hmm. Let's see who can they hit. Well, they do have a good sight on a few of them, and these guys over here have a good sight on a few others. Let's see. Destructible terrain becomes rough terrain when destroyed. Open the tactical map and select Sark. Where are you at? Right over here. Mm, okay, so he's hiding. To pass a unit's turn, select the hold action and press confirm. This uses a tactical point. So, five. <laughs> Sark must stay stationary for three rounds to download data. Hold your position until evacuation. So you need to stay down here in the back. Evacuation right over here. So basically all we're doing is holding our position, which means we're going to get swarmed here in a minute. So I want my guys to have good cover to hide behind. I'm thinking maybe like right over here, but then they'd be completely exposed on that end. Um, hmm. Not the greatest places for these dudes. This one right here is actually pretty good. And maybe up here would be really, really nice for these guys. So let's actually move them up. Let's get these guys going over here. And it does look like they moved up a little bit too. Now they're hiding behind the destructible terrain. 
So they took that out so they could have a clear line of sight at my guys. Uh, ZK, this game is really, really fun. It is kind of, uh, you know, pushing me to think a little bit more uh, carefully before I go in there and attack just random, random mobs. Let's see, we want to... We want to attack these guys, but we want to do it with the plasma gun. Yeah, I like that. So you can kind of see what the percentage chance is for certain guys. 78%, uh, 56%. Negative three, but we didn't kill any of them. They're out in the open. These guys are pretty tough. Not digging that. All right, what are they gonna do? They're gonna move up, they're gonna attack. Destroyed. I didn't even see them attack anything. We must be getting people over here on this side. Let's come over here and take a look real quick. No, there's nobody over there. All right, we're just gonna deal with it then. We'll see what happens. Now, this guy is definitely a melee guy. What we could possibly do is come over here, use this as cover, and then get up on top of them. But we're I'm not quite sure if that's going to work. I mean, you know, we, we tried to get close to him last time. We ended up getting annihilated. But <laughs> let's give it a shot and see how it works. We're going to go with move. Mm. No, no, we're not going to go with those guys after all. It's, uh, it's just a little bit outside their reach. Can we click off of them? So we can't use them again. We can, however, use these guys. Can't use assault either, so we're just gonna go with a regular shot. I like the result of that one. Now you can see his guy still had armor on and he died anyways. Ah, here we go. Our first. What are you guys shooting at? It's not even anything over here. Ah, oh, okay. I see they were clearing the path for more of their dudes, which are going to just warp in as time goes on. Okay, what about you guys? I can't use them. Scrub. We'll go ahead and use these guys then. We're going to try to take this one out. Getting low. Target and destroy. Yeah, not as good as I was hoping. Alright, what are you guys gonna do next? Almost, guys. They almost got a full cleared area. And then this thing over here. I guess maybe they're going to shoot this thing. Who knows? Still wish it could be explosions. Let's see. Yep, we're going to try one more time over here. Suppression fire. All right, one more left. They lost three on that one. Yeah. That's perfect. One more shot like that, and this whole squad is gone. They are obsessed with those things. Hmm. Well, we can't hit this guy. He's a little too far away with that squad anyways. I, I mean, I guess we could try, but the farther away he is... You know, the less likely likely we are to hit them. Uh, these guys are behind cover. These guys, however, completely out in the open and very, very close. I'm surprised nobody died on that one. As close as those guys were. Come on, guys. Attack me back. You're too easy. 
Is that it? Really, I get another turn. All right, we'll take it. No complaining here. Oh, yeah, two down. One more to go. Should we try? I think we are. I think we're going to try to wipe out this squad. Didn't quite do it. Took all his armor off. So the next hit that actually gets to him should kill him. But until then, he gets a free turn. If they actually ever go, they haven't really done anything. Get to do that one more time. Those were all direct hits. Oh my god, really? You could see it on them. It wasn't a miss. At least make the, the bullets seem like they're not hitting the target you're going after. So we can't go after any of these guys. None of our guys are working. So we're going to have to come back here and deal with our main one, which is to uh, just to tell him to hold. He's just back here chilling while everybody else is doing all the work. Enemy's turn yet? Nope, not yet. All right, let's uh, change it up. We're going to go ahead and see if we can kill this dude. I do kind of want to attack those guys, but they're way off to the side, and I don't think I'm going to get good shots on them. <laughs> Seriously. What does it take to kill that guy? Are they actually going to attack? Nope, they're still not going to attack. They're still just destroying crates. I don't get them. Last level, a little harder. This level, super easy. I do kind of maybe wish there was some kind of experience points to be gained. Something I could like level up or every enemy that I kill I get credit so I could buy different armor. There we go. Finally. Never been so happy to see my troops actually getting attacked. Who they had? Yeah, it was this squad they, they attacked. Alright, so we need to take that guy out. Let's do that now. One hit. That's all it's going to take. One hit. <laughs> now, when we first saw the, the very first cutscene, he took some damage to his shoulder pad where the emblem was when the bullets hit them. They're not doing that. And kind of annoying me a little bit. Right, we're going to attack with these guys. Now, these are the special ones. They have the plasma on them. And I think what we should do... We can't hit these guys. They're still in cover. But we can get these guys... Hmm. Yeah, a lot lower on the chances because they're behind cover than these guys. So we're going to go ahead and hit these guys instead. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> we annihilated the entire squad because they were out in the open. Nice. They completely missed us on that. Script. Let's see, what if we move these guys? If we move them, the closest they can get is right here, just because of all that debris. Mm, well, you know, they're kind of out in the open anyways. I don't think they're getting any protection there. So, yeah, let's to move out. Let's try to, you know, charge them. I want to see this sword being used in combat. Even if, like, all my guys die over here, I want to see that sword being used. That might be... Uh, Be a bad idea, but I think it's still a good one. Scrub. All right, we're gonna move up. I'm gonna try to keep them behind cover as much as possible. Hmm. If we get them here, they're within range, sorta. 
So let's let's keep him behind this wall. Prepare to move out. Because you know they're gonna attack him here. Well, I guess I shouldn't say that. They they've been kind of not aggressive lately. What the crap? We got people over here now. Wow, they are really, really far away. I didn't even see them show up. I do like how I don't have to go around the rocks. Kind of makes things a little easier. Okay, so I can't use them anymore. I still have shots on these guys. Unfortunately, nobody is within their range. I would have to kind of move them off to the side. And they're going to get another set of people over here. So, hmm. I think I'm gonna keep them there. I like the fact that they're behind cover. What about you guys? What can you hit? Can you hit any of these dudes? No, they sure can't. And they can't hit them either. But they can stand there and get shot at, which is exactly what they've been being kind of used for as target practice. So what I could do is I could move them up over here. They would be doubly exposed over there, but not so much over here. Hmm. I don't know about that. Yeah, I gotta get a lot closer to hit those. I guess let's just see if we can hit these guys. See how, how what the percentage is. 46%? 28? I don't think we're gonna do any damage. But let's, let's give it a shot. Minus three. Oh, not too shabby. A little bit. <laughs> I'm not too happy with that, but whatever. We'll take it. Minus two. Alright, we're going to attack back. Yeah, I was expecting maybe one of them to die, but minus three is okay. So I, I guess this is just, you know, I could always tell that guy to hold at the end of the round, but I think we just try to annihilate as many people as we can so we don't get overwhelmed, which I guess is kind of cool. I would like to see more of a storyline to do with these missions, more moving around, more positioning like the last level. This one's not as exciting as I was kind of hoping it would be. We can't attack. Yeah, because they're in the way. Hmm. Guess we are going to have to move them a little bit. We'll move them out here. Ah, oh, look at that. We finally got more people over there on that side. Now these guys are going to start getting attacked. Alright, we got one more shot on these before the round is over. And even though I think we have taken a little bit of damage here and there, I think we're still doing pretty well. <laughs> yeah, extremely well after that. That little hit over there. Now we have nobody here on this side to do any damage. And they have, what, two, four troops left? Mm. Yeah, not a good idea to move this guy out. But when I did, there was nobody over there, so we'll take it. I should have stayed behind cover. I knew it was a bad idea, but I did anyways. Hey, Cypher Deck. Uh, happy holidays, Merry Christmas, all that stuff, guys. Uh, Cypher Deck is going to be joining us later on the stream along with ZK to give out some keys. I'll be giving out keys this morning as well on my own, and then uh, even more later on. We got over 25 keys to give away for 15 different games, so definitely uh, stay tuned for all of that, guys. We've already given out one today, and uh, it was um, 
Van Thier, who won that one. So big congrats goes out to him, man. Hmm, didn't I tell this guy to, to chill already? Definitely not gonna make it. If I move him up here, he's gonna get shot immediately by like four different people. Prepare to move out. Let's move him over here. He's still gonna be exposed everywhere, and he's about to die, which is a shame because he's like, you know, he's he's a pretty beastly looking dude. We didn't even get to see him use his sword. And you're dead. Oh, really? It's a miss. He gets to live. Scrap. Oh, baby, you bet to do some good damage before you die, man, because you are Suppression not going to very long. What? You didn't even use your sword, dude. I got you. I got him out of here so he could use his sword. And he didn't even use it. I don't. I don't feel so bad that you're dead, dude. You really. All right, we got some two, uh, some troops over here that were not there a minute ago. <laughs> Down goes blue. Yeah, he, I was expecting more out of that guy, which I guess is good that we found out ahead of time, so that I don't go into battle later on thinking he's gonna be like the end all be all, because he wasn't. Negative three. I'll take those. Now, the guy that I do kind of have a thing for is the one with the plasma. Yeah, I just said I had a thing for a guy. Now, uh, that, <laughs> the plasma guy. He's actually doing really, really well. Okay, let's, let's show off just how well he does by killing off the last of this troop. 100% chance. Look at that, guys. 100% chance that he's going down. <laughs> That's the guy sucks. Oh, poor, poor enemy. If only he stood a chance. It does take the... Com there we go. It does take the computer play a few seconds sometimes to figure out what he wants to do. Can we hit this stuff over here? Still cannot hit these guys over here. That's like my, my weak point right now. 56, it's not gonna do too much damage, but we'll give it a shot. Wow, okay, well, I was wrong. 56% chance is an amazing percentage when it comes to absolute luck, I guess. What about you guys? Well, they missed my guys. I still have yet to see them counterattack and actually do anything. They counterattack, but I never see any damage actually being taken. Take a little bit of damage. We got this one solo guy all by himself. Came in very, very lonely to the game. No, no friends whatsoever. So you guys are finally going to have a target over here on this side. Maybe. Yes, yes, you do. Yeah, it would be cool, too, if they leveled them up as far as, um, you know, skill points go. Like, the more they kill, the more they survive in battle. They get ranked up, I guess, is what I'm trying to get at. Because it is kind of difficult to keep these guys alive. 
the more they're in battle, the less likely they are to, you know, continue on with that that tradition. Forty-five percent, fifty percent. It's amazing that these guys actually have a slightly better chance of getting shot. So we'll go with them. Fifty percent ain't bad, guys. Fifty percent ain't bad. Anything underneath that is uh, not that great, though. somebody they found a brave cause though let's see we could attack back maybe over there if they can hit us we should be able to hit them but I, I kind of want to kill this dude 52% chance 19 yeah that's not gonna happen <laughs> uh, love how the last shots go tink 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 yeah it kind of hits their armor I really, really wish, though, it would give you battle damage. One of the cool things about painting these dudes up was the very first time you do it, you make them look all pretty. You know, you get them all, you know, shining like they just came off the assembly line. And then later on, after you've been playing for a little while, you start giving them some battle damage, you know, giving them some scuffs here and there and kind of letting your uh, imagination run wild with what kind of, uh, you know, encounters they've gone through. Or maybe even like, you know, you keep it going with the whole RPG, the role-playing aspect of knowing what encounters they've got through and giving them battle damage for it. Oh, one more hit and he should be dead. But I don't think we're going to get one more hit with our troops. I think these guys are out of turns. Nice. That's a good miss right there. I am out of turn, so these guys are going to be the ones that hold. This should be the last round that I have to do this for, for these guys to get the information that they are trying to get. That's what I like to see. Some good misses. All right, so I am going to move my guy over here. Still says hold, remaining round zero. We're gonna we're gonna try moving these guys a little bit. Hopefully, I don't have to start the whole thing over. Uh, it's early access, so I guess if you really wanted a turn for probably a little bit of the, uh, like a little bit of alpha or something. But it's almost fully done, I think. The game is out on the market. You can buy it right now. Uh, but I did get access to it from the company. They, they went ahead and sent me a Steam key for it, which I thought was very, very cool. Get to play the game a little bit before most people will. There we go. That's all we had to do, guys. All right, and while that's going on, we're going to go ahead and do our second Steam key of the day. We are going to be giving out another key to uh, Mortars VR. Now, remember, guys, the question, first person to give me the answer wins the key. What was the name of the guy that created Warhammer 40K? You can use YouTube, or not YouTube, uh, Google if you need. Just the first person to give me the right answer gets a key. Let's see. We're going to go with uh, click new to create a new army. Oh, so we get to create our new army now. Sweet. All right. New army. We got deployment 0 out of 300. Support 0 out of 70. We're going to call this uh, Drac. Click on the newly created army. We're gonna go with deploy. What? Well, we haven't even put anything in. Can we edit it? Yeah, we can. 
Can you play Tyranids? I, I do not know if we can play them just yet. We just started the game. It is uh, VR hostable, so you can play it in the VR headset if you've got an HTC Vive or an Oculus Rift. So we went through a tutorial on kind of teaching you the basics of the game and what you can do, uh, all that kind of stuff. Remember, guys, the question is, who created Warhammer 40K? You get a free Steam key for uh, a new VR game that just came out. All right, you can add individuals to your army here. Individuals cost deployment points. Some, such as the sergeant, also cost support points. So, yeah, depending on uh, how many points we got is who we can put in there. Add 10 standard legionnaires to your army by clicking on their panel. Legionnaires only have standard bolters. Uh, no, you can Google. You can Google all you want, guys. Uh, whoever gets it first, I do not mind. I, I did make some of these questions a little hard, so... All right, so we need to have uh, 10 of these guys. All right, add four veterans. Veterans may swap their bolters for special weapons. That is what I'm going to like. I'm going to like the uh, the plasma gun. <laughs> Man. Uh, you could whisper somebody if you want, but you've already won the game, so I don't think you want another key for the exact same game. All right, we got four there. Add a single sergeant. Sergeants have limited weapon options, but excel in assault. No, they don't. <laughs> They're not that great. All right, so that is uh, fully outfitted, I guess. We can't put more in there. We don't have enough. Select the equip tab to equip the legionnaires you have added to your army. All right, so let's go ahead and equip those. Select this veteran from your current army list. Equipping special weapons to units costs special points. Okay, special points, I guess, is going to be the 3 out of 70. We can go with the regular Bolter. We can go with the Flamer. Attacks also affect any units within the Flamer's range behind the target area. So we can hit multiple enemies because these flames go so far. I like the sound of that. The first individual in target has its armor halved by this attack. That could be kind of cool. Improved firing solution ignores any cover bonus that a target has towards a uh, shot action. That could really, really come in power, very, uh, very powerful. Strike them down does not cost AP multiples, multiplies the assault value of any assault action used this turn. Mm. I mean, it's it's great and all, but I, I don't know how well that's going to play out for us. Uh, wow, there's a lot. No one steps back. Sharpshooter has the potential to instantly kill a target model really want to try that <laughs> I really really want to try that all right let's see what else we got we got plasma gun greatly increases attack but may backfire causing death or damage uh, missile launcher adds an additional two shots per individual in the targets unit Wow yeah please heavy bolter target uses unit loses a tactical point ah. so what do you guys think we should go with you guys have a, a favorite weapon you want to see me try out? I think we're going to try out a few different weapons and see how they work out. But uh, I'm going to go with the plasma gun to start with because I really, really like the plasma gun. If it will let me use it. All right, continue. Equip the selected veteran with a flamer by clicking on the flamer. Okay, so they want me to go down there around instead. Okay, so he already has a flamer there. Find the plasma gun and equip it to the selected veteran. All right, so we're going to go with a plasma... No, that's not a plasma gun. Plasma gun. Heavy bolter. And we're going to find the missile launcher. That's the one I wanted anyways. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I like it. Uh, can we pick any of these? I want to give... Oh, okay, so like the sergeant. Equip your sergeant with a plasma pistol. And swap your sergeant's chainsaw for a power sword. Melee weapons special. Okay, so let's get rid of his power sword. And go with a power sword. Uh, these are abilities. They are bought like equipment and are equipped into the ability slot. Abilities have powerful, unique effects, but have activation limits. Your army is now complete. Press save and exit, then deploy from the army. All right, so 
Can I not? You're not gonna let me use any of these, huh? We'll have to come back and try them later. You can see that it's virtually the same as these guys over here as far as support goes. We're at 24 out of 70. Can I edit it now? No, they won't let me edit. I want to go in there and do more to it, but they won't. Hey guys, and welcome to the disembodied voice of AC Gamer. We are definitely going to be doing a lot more series in the future, but here are a few of them that you guys might find interesting. Of course, you're more than welcome to check them out. I would love to hear your comments. Again, if you do enjoy these videos, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe. It's definitely the indicator that I use to uh, tell if you guys want to see more videos like that of that particular game style of that uh, you know series in the long run so when you guys leave comments down it helps me decide whether we should keep doing it as well as whether you want to see games like that in the future and here are a few of them right here I kind of picked out uh, a few of different genres we will be doing spotlights for other youtubers in the future so if you uh, want to get a little shout out definitely let me know if you group with me uh, chances are you will get a shout out in here eventually but for now these are just uh, four series that I have that I feel like uh, could use a little bit more attention and that you guys might actually enjoy as well thanks again for watching guys and we will definitely catch you all next time